Hey V Squad, welcome back to Vlogstreet. If you're new here, I'm Victoria and this is my channel. So in today's video, as you saw by the title, we're going to be doing a makeup collection for 12 year olds. I'm going to be 13 in June, which is like 3 to 4 months. <laughs> um, and that's like exciting, but I'm still 12, so yeah. And my makeup collection is not really neat, so I'm really sorry about that. And it's like not really like, gorgeous, but I love my makeup. And yeah, before we start this video, click the subscribe button, give this video a huge thumbs up, and click the notification bell so you can always notified when I post a new video and never miss one. And yeah, so let's just get on with the video. Okay, guys, so in this corner is my lipstick collection. So basically, I just have my um, little lipstick collection. It's on this swirly thing, so I can just spin it around, um, as you guys can see. Um, so basically here I have my NYX lips, lip glue lipsticks. Um, then I have some essential oils here and some lip glosses, some stuff that I didn't really use. I just kept keep it for display. Um, then here um, I have my perfumes. I don't use these perfumes, but they're fit in the little cat cubbies because they're not really big these cubbies so it's perfect for my perfumes there's nothing here but there used to be like little boxes that i filled with my lip glosses that i used to make um then i have here all my nude shades and all my shades that i don't really use i mean these two i use but they're i have extras of those because i got it from my advent calendar so the two back ones you guys can't really see it but they're there and then here's a black one and the brown and i don't really use it and by the way i bedazzled the whole thing because i was a little obsessed with bedazzling i mean i loved glitter um i still do and then i have here my lip lipsticks so all my lipsticks i don't really use lipsticks except this is my Jeff show bullet like lipstick um but yeah um and then here i like to keep it on this side because that's all my lip lipsticks and they're the prettiest because they're all color coordinated i have all my lipsticks oh my god they keep on falling sorry if like my hair is touching the mic i'm really sorry but um here i have my jeffree star lip lips look at lipsticks um this is the one i use the most jeffree star like lips like look lipstick at, at, on the shade in the shade thick as thieves that's my favorite shade i don't know if they sell it anymore but and then here's my mini liquid lipsticks and then there's my glosses but um, i like to keep it on here and yeah and then if you guys head over here in this little area is my skincare area so this is all my skincare products um i don't really have i mean i do have a lot of skincare but i feel like i have more makeup but some people consider skincare as makeup i think it's important to take care of your skin but yeah that's my skincare corner <laughs> Okay guys, so now onto the fun part, the makeup. So first things first, I have this first drawer. You guys can't really see, but I'll have a little overlay. Overlay, but here. So basically all I have is my eyeshadows, my single shadows like these, my little next ones, next ones that I got in my um, first calendar that I got, 2018, 2019. Basically the very small ones, all my single eyeshadows. And then here I have my daily makeup, and I also have my makeup remover really, like jump, like on top of everything. But I have my daily makeup, which consists of my um, mascara primer. It's like literally the best thing ever. Then I have my um, y Y7 um, mascara and forever lash. I was trying to find the Maybelline one. I picked this one up because they have similar packaging. So now I'm like, I can't return it. But um, yeah. And then I have my Honest Essie Beverly Hills Clear Brow Gel. It's like the best thing ever. Then I have my Tarte Shape Deep and my Neutral. And then I have my NARS Beauty Creamy Concealer and um, Cream Brulee. Cream brulee. And then over here, right here in this section, I have my sprays and my little thingies to put my toner on. So these are my sprays. I just have my all nighter and my Nick Milk Hydro Grip Primer. I got it on my next Okay. And then over here is my little, I guess like powders corner. I have my L Putty Primer. I love it so much that I have a second one. It's like the best thing ever. Then I have a Camel D primer. I mean, we don't know where. <laughs> and then we have um a bare minimal bare minerals for lush peach perfect powder okay i know Too faced does this whole scandal and everything like that but i love the peach perfect powder it's the best thing ever if you haven't tried it that's the only thing i would get yeah and then i have a becca bronzer hula bronzer the like glitter and then like another powder random powder and then over here on the side by the way i had this whole benefit thingy i got all this minis champion 
I think it's really cute and it's really convenient if you want to try them all out. And for it's actually a really good price. Here I have all my eyeshadow pigment, all the glitters. And then back here I have my eyeshadow, like um, cream, my cream eyeshadows. So I have like the Stila ones. These are the best cream ones, I would say. Oh my god. I didn't even pick up any product. That's too funny. Like, look at that. This is a highlighter one, but I use it as eyeshadow because um, I don't really want glitter all over my face. Blushes right in this little corner, but I don't really use any of these blushes. They're just here, and then I have all my sponges. So what I have is my Beauty Blender by Morphe, and then I have two because one of them I use for powder. Oh, it's glitter. So gorgeous. Okay. And then over here, I just have some powders. I just have some um, but powder, just powders. My Elf Putty Primer, and then... The Tunix highlighters that I have, and the Tarte uh, Park Avenue Princess waterproof bronzer, and then over here I have my Jeffree highlighter, but it cracked, which is very unfortunate. So I tried putting it together with rubbing alcohol, and that was with, like alcohol, and I really don't like it, like rubbing alcohol, and actual alcohol. But yeah, and then here is my favorite bronzer, Anastasia Beverly Hills Saddle Bronzer. Sorry if we talk really fast. Then I have my Cody Airspun powder. Then I have my Fenty Beauty highlighter in the shade. Hustle Baby and Mean Money. I bought this in the Sephora Favorites. And then I have my favorite highlighter ever, which is the Becca Champagne Pop Highlighter. It's that. They're like limited edition one. So the packaging was gorgeous. And also Champagne Pop. It's gorgeous. I only like gold highlighters. This was perfect for me. Okay. On to the next category. Okay, guys. Now on to this part. This is like the biggest section, I guess. Um... Okay, so first things first, once you open it, when you open it, you see a bunch of categories and you're like, oh my god, this is overwhelming. But let me just walk you through them. So first things first, on this side of my brushes, and I cleaned all my eyeshadow brushes recently. Took a long time. But then I used them, so now they're dirty, so sorry my brushes are really dirty. Oh, I mean, I clean them every month. Every three weeks. Okay, and then here, I have my um, brushes. These are some brushes that my sister got me one year for my birthday. Or for Christmas. So I just filmed the other part, but let me just walk you through this, this way. It's much easier. So oh, back here, I have all my setting sprays and my Morphe Beauty Sponges by Jeffree Star or Beauty Blenders. Then I have my primers, a bunch of primers. Then I have concealers, foundation, my favorite foundation. And then, sorry, that wasn't my way. And then there's face masks over there and samples. And then in the middle, I have eyelashes. And then I have brushes. Exciting and part. All my palettes. Okay, so first and first, on top, I have my baby, my bloodlust. Love this. Uh -huh. So we'll put this to the side. Stay safe. Uh -huh. And then I just have over here just some cotton squares and have my little travel stuff. I love using these. I always get these at BeautyCon. I get so many, so many, and I use these always to travel. So yeah, and then I have my little travel stuff back there. And here I have all my palettes. I don't use any of these. TBH, oh. These two are Claire's palettes. I don't even know why I still have them. Um, the only reason why I had them because I broke them up and put them back and they didn't really work. So don't mind that. And I think I did the same to this one. But these smell awful and disgusting. And I didn't want to show. And then this is the uh, oh my god. This is the LA Colors I Love Makeup Contour Palette. I never used it because I heard that they don't use good ingredients, so I didn't use it. I'm traveling, especially because it is the Deles de Pude de Pude de Pude. Pudre. Oh my god, this is all in another language because I bought this in London. I think that shouldn't be. But this is not so like um, chocolate I thought it did. Everybody had these at one time. I got this last year. But I know I don't really use this anymore as much, but it's still here. And then here, oh my god, and this detached. Me and my friend were trying to play with makeup and um, it's kind of detached. So that's really sad, but I love this palette. Well loved, well used. Okay, the Bella Pierre one. Oh my god, look at my hands. And then back here I have a Kevin D palette. We don't speak about that. Four favors. I always get the Sephora favors for my birthday or for Christmas because I love them. And then I have my blue bed. I like three of these palettes. <laughs> love that. Um, then I have my favorite day palette that I use every day. Then I have my brain freeze, my baby. Um, and then I just have all my eyeshadow palettes here, and then I have my Ever Beauty Giselle Bundet Bundle by ColourPop. Then I have my Modern Renaissance, my Too Faced palette, Too Faced Chocolate, Too Faced uh, Chocolate Gold. I mean, that one's really good. Um, then I have my Naked palette, 
Urban Decay Naked Palette in Smoky, and then I have um, a Mermaid Palette, a random Mermaid Palette, and then I have a Hoodie Beauty Palette, and then a couple more down there. And then I have another fave, my Morphe Jeffree Star Palette, Ace Mer. So guys, like just started. Yeah, I don't want to put my dirty hands in my mouth. And then I have all my Morphe palettes basically here, and then I have my Jaclyn Hill palette. It is well loved. I mean, I don't really use it anymore. I used to be obsessed with using it because it's really my only palette. Um, now my James Charles palette, really well loved too, but I haven't hit pan on any of the shades, so I'm not planning on, on getting any new ones of this, just because I haven't hit pan. Even though, like a lot of people are like, you should get a new one, but I'm like, I didn't hit pan on them. They're bare, look like they're barely touched, even though most of them are really well loved. Okay guys, this is the end of the video, but I have many shoutouts to shout out. So if you guys, Follow my Instagram. My Instagram is Victoria Crystal 2007. Don't like my posts. You know the drill. Like and follow. Um, but um, I did an Instagram live two times, and I'm gonna go live more. But um, and we did some shoutouts. So here are the shoutouts. So for the first live, I'm live one of my best friends, Ella. Um, and so the winner for that live is Paisley underscore and one two three. I love you, Paisley. Um, she commented Pod Rocks. She commented, who's your, what's your favorite candy? And then, and then Caitlin's Room also commented. Caitlin's Room on Instagram. Um, she also has a YouTube channel. She's really nice. Um, she commented, like, the candy, little chair emoji. It also had a comment, the chair emoji. And then Bianca Maria, Bianca underscore Maria, dot zero seven. Love you, Bianca. She goes to school with me. She's the best. Love you, Bianca. Bianca, if you're watching this. <laughs> And she commented, my favorite candy is probably gummies also. We love gummies. Me and my best friend, Ella. Well, one of my best friends, Ella. We love gummies. Okay. And then also, and we also got MaddieWise.x. MaddieWise on Instagram. So everything's going to be right here. And link in the description box. So, yeah. And Bita Shia. Sorry for pronouncing your name wrong. Really sorry. Bita Shia underscore Maharine and Maddie Wise. So those are the shout outs. And... Yeah, is Maya underscore Zagaruski and Paisley underscore Anne one two three Paisley you're on top of the game. <laughs> and then we have Melly underscore Andrade twelve, and then Rachel Pink one, and then Paisley again. Oh Paisley, ooh, and same people, and then Abilene underscore Com. Palmbury, and then Can Cam Cami underscore five, and yeah. Thank you guys so so much for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Click the subscribe button. Give this video a huge thumbs up. Click the notification bell if you want to be notified every time I post a video. And then you'll be part of the hashtag V Squad. Isn't that so cute? Hashtag V Squad. And also on Instagram, I made my own. Sorry for the. Sorry, it's really annoying. Then maybe on hashtag, hashtag Vlogs Victoria. So if you want to post anything about me, just use the hashtag, hashtag V Squad or hashtag Vlogs Victoria, and you'll get noticed in the next video, and you'll get a follow. So if you use the hashtag V Squad or tag and tag me, or hashtag Vlogs Victoria and tag me, then you're on the roll, and yeah, you'll get a follow and a shout out on my Instagram. Sorry for everybody on the live who couldn't get a shout out on the Instagram, it's not working or whatever. It's just not linking everybody, so it was really annoying. So I'm doing them on YouTube. And yeah, so all you have to do for a shout out for the next video, and also I'm going live today, all you have to do is go to my Instagram, make a post using the hashtag VSquad in Vlogs Victoria and tag me, and then you'll get a follow. And thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed it, and love you guys. See you next time.